going. Hi, welcome to the Kaka Pit stop. Um, this is the fruit stand, this is it. The fruit stand, and then this is where we cut the sugar cane and have the sugar cane press. all the action and so usually we'll start here we'll kind of look at the fruit and uh, I like to start them off with um, samples and so I will sample the rainbow papaya first because it's I think less sweet of the two um, but they're both extremely sweet um, there are no wonky papayas here right now but um, this is your rainbow papaya yeah they get pretty big two knives at work. Um, I will slice it. Okay, well, let's pretend. I slice downward and then towards me and that gives them a nice slice to pull uh, and make sure that the knife is facing towards you and not towards them, you know. It's just... And then these are the strawberry pies and the label. The cute little signs. Then I'll move on to um, usually I like to start with the star fruit. So we've got star fruit in this area for now, and that's because it's a more watery, really refreshing fruit. See here, but um, I'd say out of all these fruits, they have the less, the least taste. And so um, I'll start them with this, and I'll just, I'll for sample, I'll cut off the butt. And then I'll get a nice slice around here so that it looks like a star. When you slice it, it looks like a star straight on. And just, you know, little tiny slices for each person. And then now we have tangerines. So I would move over to the tangerines, peel a section, and then give them a little piece. Um, and then just talk about our citrus in general. We have lemons over here in the yellow crate. And then we have oranges in the bottom, basket of the circles. After that, I think uh, I would move on to the lily koi, passion fruit. Okay, so we're doing this still pretty like acidic, very tasty, watery fruits. Okay, so lily koi slash passion fruit. It, it, lily koi, I believe, means passion fruit. And um, yeah, when you, I usually, okay, so this is it sliced like that and see how and tip is sliced like so. So that's the first slice I'll make and then I'll just give them the butt end and they can just slurp it and also eat the seeds. You can let them know that. Um, and describe it as a sweet tart candy. And yeah. And I would also say try everything um, you can here so that it just, I don't know, we have more to talk about. How you Bananas are next. You just sample all the bananas. We have a mess of them here. Right now we have um, lady fingers that are really sweet. I say the sweetest. They're the smallest too. And then we have lots of apple bananas, which are these. And you can tell, I mean, some apple bananas, a lot of them are small actually. And um, some of them get pretty big, like this size and even bigger. So, yes. And with the bananas, you just peel apart and I leave half of the peel here on the bottom where your hand is and you just slice them and let them grab their own seeds. And then, oh, to complement the bananas, um, I always, after I have them try the bananas, I bring up the macadamia nuts and they're raw actually. And so I ask them if they've ever tried raw macadamia nuts. And then talk about how fresh they are and how much sweeter they are than uh, roasted macadamia nuts and how amazingly well they complement the bananas. And it's Joe's. You'll hopefully get to meet this great guy. It's his favorite snack. And uh, he'll describe it as a banana nut bread or muffin sort of snack without the carbs. So you know, it's a little something you can say too. Um, right now we... Pineapple. Oh. Yeah, I'll also mention the pineapple. Um, either in the beginning when I talk about the papaya, because usually we've been giving a free papaya with the pineapple. So you, 
you can say, oh yes, and we also have really juicy, yummy, ripe pineapple. Um, that I, I mean, it depends on whether you're alright with cutting it, slicing it up and putting it in a bag. So you, I am, I have been doing that, so I just say, I can cut that up and bag that up for you. We have forks, napkins, and you also get a free supply for that. And then they ask for the price and they tell them the price. But uh, yeah, people are usually always into that, especially when you say that you cut it up for them and put it in the bag and have napkins. Um, so that's a pineapple, and then uh, we, we have avocados right now, and uh, sometimes we'll make. Oh, yeah. Oh my gosh, what's fine?